for the first time in at least half a year, I'm happy. I feel free after making this decision. And I'm so happy I am. In the world of alpine skiing, few names have made an impact in recent times quite like Lucas Brothen. Hailing from Hoxund and representing Barum Ski Club, Lucas quickly rose to the top, securing accolades like the Alum Cup in the World Cup season of 2022-2023. But beyond the ski slopes, Lucas is a vibrant and charismatic figure. His dual heritage with a Norwegian father and Brazilian mother only adds layers to his global appeal. Engaging and genuine, Lucas's active presence on social media made him a fan favorite. <laughs> Yet, recent events took the skiing world by surprise. So thank you for that, and, uh, and thanks for me. I'm out. The joy I once had for the sport, it's gone. Lucas's exit comes in the wake of a fierce disagreement with the Norwegian Ski Federation over image rights. Image rights allow an athlete to control and financially benefit from the use of their likeness in promotions and advertisements. For Lucas, this was not just about money, but about autonomy, personal branding and aligning with brands that resonated with his values. However, to represent Norway means abiding by the sponsorships dictated by the Norwegian Ski Federation. This requirement is where the friction began. Interestingly, Lucas isn't the only one grappling with this issue. Johannes Hostvot Klebo, another skiing prodigy, has similar reservations. In fact, Klebo hasn't signed an agreement with the national team, which means shockingly he might not compete in this year's World Cup. Earlier this year, Lucas made waves by partnering with one of the federation's competing brands. This act, amplified by a particular Instagram video, further strained his relationship with the Federation. From his unforgettable win in Zolden in 2020, to his remarkable climb from 29th to 1st place in Wangen in 2022, Lucas's journey has been nothing short of spectacular. But the question remains, is this the end of the road for Lucas representing Norway? With the Brazilian mother, could a shift in allegiance be on the horizon for Lucas? Only time will tell. Lucas's departure from the Norwegian skiing scene is undoubtedly profound, but his legacy remains. A prodigious skier, a social media sensation, and now a symbol of an athlete's fight for personal rights. For more insights into the Nordic skiing and running world, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And let us know if you'd like a deep dive into Johannes Hosflot Klebo's standoff with the Norwegian Ski Federation.